Welcome everybody, it's Nathan's Pop Hunt. I'm the Nathan. These are the Pops, of course. And we have more Pops. Ta-da! Look, my giant ass was hiding this giant box. Um, so recently, uh, the lovely folks at PP Joe uh, had a sale, I think you could kind of class it on as an offer. Um, so essentially they said, hold on to this and open it. Um, they said, on Friday last week, Thursday, something like that, uh, towards the end of last week, everything for five, six hours was half price. So I bought loads. <laughs> uh, so yeah, this is essentially a load of full price pops cheap. Um, a lot of recent ones. So there's stuff in here that's only just come out. There's stuff that some places haven't got yet. Uh, bring me chair a bit closer because I'm going to mount these down here. Because there's some others I have to show you as well. Uh, I'm going to rip this box open because it's a box in a box. And then we'll get to it. So, firstly, what I will show you is we have here The Flash. Uh, the Flash has just started back yesterday on Sky, uh, so Series 7, so seeing as though I got Godspeed, wherever he is, over there, um, in my last Pop in a Box thing, I thought I'd get the Flash because I saw him in Tesco for £10. What I also saw in Tesco is over yonder, and I've already taken him out of the box as well, it's Godzilla with the heat ray, uh, not the glow-in-the-dark one, uh, but this, again, the paint job on this is really quite good, except for the fact that every different piece seems to have been done differently. So, yeah, the fire is removable, because uh, I've noticed in the box you can only see that. But this is actually stuck into the plastic insert. Uh, there's just a really weirdly shaped hole up in his mouth. That goes in and gets thrown on the floor. <laughs> um, but there it goes so that's quite cool um, we've also got the Iron Patriot uh, recently went up on Funko Europe so this really cool uh, what well, this is the Iron Patriot Mark II I think you class is from Endgame uh, so very happy I've been saying for a while they should be doing one of those and they have and then finally we've also got Hot Rocks. Uh, so Hot Rocks is an infinity warp. It is um, the human torch and the thing. Really quite cool. I love a bit of translucent plastic, hence that, hence this. Um, so yeah, I don't think anything else new has arrived. I've sold a few bits here and there. But yeah, other than that, that's it. Um, so let's take off this box. So we ordered Five, I think. One of which is, ironically with the Flashes, is Kid Flash, which is the comics version, not the TV series version. But that one comes as a with a chance of a chase, so there's a glow-in-the-dark version. So hopefully we get that. Uh, we've also got some Falcon and Winter Soldiers, and another one that I can't quite remember the name of. Um, full of packing peanuts. This is the one that I wanted the most though, because this is normally £30 for most places. I ordered it, I actually put a pre-order in for, and it's actually in a pot protector as well. So PV Joe, primarily a pot protector company, um, but this is the first one of these giant pops that I've got in a pot protector. But it's coming out of the box. So you can see it properly. You can probably see what it is now, but yeah. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Ta-da! It is Mickey Mouse driving the Jungle Cruise boat. Uh, so we already have a Jungle Cruise, which I ordered from America, and cost me 60-odd quid, with postage and such. And now you can pick them up in a sale on the Disney website for a lot less than that. 
that's a pain in the ass. And this one cost me £15. Uh, now, as I say, I ordered it, I put a pre order in with Zavi, um, and that was only £20. Pop in a box, I've got it at 30 So, yeah, it's. It seems to be one of these pops that everywhere is making available um, at a reasonable price, and it's not a Parks exclusive or anything like that, so that's very cool, and I'm very happy with it. So, we'll leave the Flash until last, because what they also do with PP Joe is they give you, they do pop protectors, but they know a lot of people have already got protectors from other companies and stuff, so they do pop sleeves as well. Um, so it's a little plastic sleeve that goes over the pop but inside the protector. So as you can see, this is a Captain America from the Falcon and Winter Soldier. Um, and he has their pop protector, but he also has this kind of edging around it that is for one of their sleeves. So they do Marvel ones, they do horror ones, they do wrestling ones make it look like they're stood in a ring they do loads of different ones um and this is the marvel one so this is captain america obviously sam wilson from the falcon winter soldier um too reflective so what we've got here is three pieces of plastic not letting me show you the figure um so we will take it out and we will show you pictures towards the end we get them out of the boxes or out the protectors However, I can do it because I am lazy, and if I have to take all of them out, probably won't happen. Uh, so yes, so we have Captain America. We also have. I'm trying not to look. The Flash is the next one on the, on the top, and I'm trying to wrestle around and find, get it, get them out without seeing if it's the chase or not. And it is not easy. Also something else in here. Let me... Oh, it's a big. It feels rubbery, um, but it's a congratulations with a code to get some discount from PV Joe as well. Um, I've also joined their affiliate scheme, so if you really want to order anything from them, they seem to have. I've looked onto their website a couple of times in the last few days just to check it out because I didn't realise they were doing pops as well. Um, but their website at the moment seems to immediately come up and say, here's 20% off or 15% off if you order within the next 20 minutes. So if you look straight in, get that, get done, you can get yourself a discount, um, which is nice. There's a link down there. I think I get something back or I, I get store credit or something like that. In, I've not really read it, but... I saw it and thought I could put a link on my website, on my website, on my descriptions and stuff. Uh, so yes, so the other one we have is the US Agent. Um, so this, John Walker, uh, formerly Captain America, uh, until, spoilers, he became Decapitation America. Um, though we never actually see if he decapitates that guy or what. Uh, but this is the suit from the end of the show. That's kind of visible. Um, you see him on the side there. Um, but yes, it's it's a darker suit than what he had, but it's very similar to the Captain America suit he wore. I didn't get him as Captain America. They would, did have that. Um, but yeah, I prefer the US agent suit, to be perfectly honest with you, with the darker colours. Um, and then the other one we had, I missed out because I forgot the time that they were going live with these. I missed out on the glow in the dark version, but if I can get the plastic bit off of this, I will show you eventually. Talk amongst yourselves. Please hold. The vision, uh, the white vision from the end of Wonder Vision. Um, yeah, they, they do a glow in the dark version of this. And yeah, it's normally 25 quid, I think. And they obviously had it 50% off. So I put it in a basket beforehand, but by the time I remembered and went online, then they didn't. But to be honest, 
the glow in the dark pops have kind of, I've got the Melisvitant and I've got a few others. They only really, if, if you constantly in the room i'm not always in this room i work here so i quite often will just walk away and try not to come in here um so i don't very often see them while i'm not working while i'm not filming these while i'm not doing stuff in here um so yeah so this one is sufficient for my uses and you will see him on a shelf floating around somewhere probably in the future um so the final one we have there's nothing else in here other than peanuts and packing paper is the Flash, or Kid Flash, should I say. Um, so, I am currently looking at the back. See? Um, which I assume would be the same, whether it's the chase or not. And because it's in a protector, I can't feel if it's the chase or not. I can't feel the sticker. So, is it? No. Uh, it's just the standardised Kid Flash. So, I may have to get him in alongside the Flash and Godspeed there and see how I feel. But again, DC sleeve on this. Um, let me pop this open. See if I can show you how this goes. So, pop protector is separate. That is all clear. Then you've still got the sleeve around the figure or the box. And then that comes off. And then you've got the box. Um, so yeah, quite cool. This one's got, it's got Wonder Woman on the corner there. It's got Aquaman, Flash. It's obviously some kind of image from DC that they've taken and carved out the middles of. Um, but yeah, so that's the, the Flash, the Kid Flash, should I say. Um, yeah, so for what you got there, I mean, that's, I had a look the other day, the pop protector I've got on Blunt Man and Chromic is from PP Joe because I've thrown multiple pop protectors out of the window and I've thrown them around and done stuff and I decided pop PP Joe are some of the best ones out there. So I ordered that for that. Seems that that's gonna be a family heirloom now because it's Kevin Smith. It's signed by Kevin Smith and Jason Muse. And if you haven't seen that video, have a hunt through December time, 2019, scroll back. Through the annals of time, have a look at that. Very, very cool story. Um, but yeah, so that's in PP Joe. That was six quid when I ordered that. So your normal pop protectors, you're probably looking a few quid each. This one's probably going to be about six quid as well. The sleeves, they're doing for a few quid in all. So to get this lot, the sleeves, the pop protectors as well, for I think I paid less than 40 quid. That was 15 for that. These were all 10 quid. Uh, yeah, these three were 10 quid each, so they were reduced to five. So that's number 15, so that's 30. And then that, I think, was about eight quid, then postage. Yeah, so about 40 quid for all of this, when normally that should cost me 30 quid. It's fantastic. That is an excellent deal from PP Joe. Uh, so by all means, like I say, there's a link down below going into that. If you order from them, I might get something back and I might be able to order some more stuff from them. Yeah, that's what we've got for you today. I have got mystery boxes on their way from Danny and Jazz. I've got two. There's one damaged one, their monthly Funko Shop exclusive one. And popping a box is due soon. And there's some other stuff as well. So, oh, while I think about it, I did get another pop. Hi, close. Oh, see the brain in the beard. It was Wally. Uh, EMP got this up. So it's the Earth Day box lunch exclusive Wally. So he's got his little plant there. Uh, they did a version with Eve with that as well. And yes, I bought that on EMP and I got a discount code that I used. They seem to, if you leave stuff in your basket long enough, they'll give you a discount code. So remember that. <laughs> I think I got 10% off. So rather than 18 quid, it was about 14, 16. So I don't know. It was less than what it should have been. I got this. I'm very happy. Thank you for joining me. Have a great day, everybody. See you soon.